Hi, this is David Bruce Leonard from the Earth Medicine Institute. I am standing next to the most traded agricultural crop in the world, coffee, which is the, I believe, the second most traded commodity in the world, next, right behind oil. Coffee is really interesting medicinal plant. It's Rubiaceae, uh, which is a very complex plant family. The coffee beans are roasted. Let me see if I can find one here. The coffee beans are roasted. They're also called coffee cherries. The outside is a really potent antioxidant. Um, very tasty. And inside there's uh, a kernel that's comprised of two pieces. And that is roasted and then ground up and turned into the coffee that we drink in the morning. One of the problems with coffee is that it can aggravate certain conditions such as fibrocystic breast disease and PMS, among other things. The Chinese call that liver chi stagnation. So a good way around this, a workaround if you want to drink coffee, is to take your roasted coffee, put it in a French press, and add room temperature water to it, and leave the plunger up on the French press. Leave it on the counter overnight. When you wake up in the morning, Press the coffee and then add um, and then reheat the water. And when you do that, you will extract the caffeine and the taste of the coffee without without pulling out the oils out of the grounds because the oils are what cause liver chi stagnation. Coffee is also used for mild depression, from um, obviously for for fatigue, and it's one of the one of the things that we'll use with, with asthma because it's a bronchodilator. This is David Bruce Leonard from the Earth Medicine Institute. Check out our website, earthmedicineinstitute.com.